So let's kick off your Friday night double right here on Fox League. It is the Dragons and the Roosters, a one-point thriller. Last time they played, and Matt Lodge, the kicker this time, right of the ruck, steadies to look for his main man, Suli, he's there. Lovely takes Suli, and he's away for St George Illawarra. Roosters are chasing Suli inside the 40. Smith, they're not going to get him. Moses Suli has turned things around from a drop ball first touch to run 90 metres to score. And they weren't good enough. He just ran the length of the field. Wow, I've, I've robbed him of five metres. It's a 95 metre run for Moses Suli. Have a look at this powerful force when he, when he gets things right. Here's, here's the speed he can run. Well, let's hope that turns it around because, it was, to, be, to be honest, it was it was very poor last week. But let's hope now he becomes the force. He had a really good Anzac Day game. He was seven tackle bust, lots of touches, damaging. Let's not get too cute. Just give him early ball and see what he can do. Yeah, he's a big, powerful athlete. Here he is, Little, to the right for Hunt. Drop and beat one and goes over. What a start! St George Illawarra fans! <laughs> it's like a new dawn! He just ducks underneath that last tackle. He knew there was space. He's got great footwork, shows, has a big show to the outside. And the Rabbitohs top of the table. He could get breathing space after the defeat of the Broncos. Oh, oh hell no! There was a collision between Smith and Lomax. Comes across the line. There you go, penalty Dragons. They can go for goal if they want this time. Lomax is successful. Happy for Zach. He is three from three tonight. Smith, left side. Kiri, nice hands. Oh, flying tackle. Lomax saves a try. Got to Butcher. Smith goes high. The Dragons defense breaks down and Tedesco jumps high and then falls over to score the try. The pass goes high. As we watch the replay, Brandon Smith jumps out, sees some space. It's flat at least. And James Tedesco gets himself a try and gets his rooster side somewhat back into the game. Jacob not square three, Jacob. Now, oh, beautiful play. Brown, and this is Tedesco, jinking, weaving, stepping, back for Kerry, cut down from behind, still gets it down. The Roosters have their second try. That's some of their best attack of the last few weeks, right there, the ball of Brown, Tedesco pushing up. Brandon Smith on the 30 metre line, getting treatment on what looks like to be a hand injury. Yeah, it looked, um, I don't think it was dislocated finger they were working on. There's the reaction of the Roosters. Make sure you pick the ball up there, Lindsay. Kiri Dummy, he's through, takes on Sloan, goes all the way. It's a double. Dummy. He hasn't been in form, and he'll tell you that. Just a beautiful show. Gets his opposite number. Junior and Moan to slide out, and then has enough speed to get around a flyer. Last tackle, they go short side, Jaden Silla! A powerful force on that, an unstoppable force right there. And buckle up for this next six minutes because it's going to be exciting football. The Roosters have got a chance there, Make sure arm. we stay onside here, guys. Go last! Turpin, Bakiri, a bomb, he'll look for Suwalehi, he gets through, but Suwalehi oh, wow. is stripped of the ball! Tedesco comes up with it! and scores and no one can take it off from the dragons hunt goes short side w and run now kicks over the top it'll come down 10 out collins was there play on still the last tackle big numbers left sloan decides to kick here come the dragons here come the dragons oh my goodness who runs these scripts rugby league Every Dragons fan is kicking this one. And they boot it into the Mr. Whippy truck. Dragons win. My goodness. What a finish.